Hello again and thank you for choosing to watch another instalment from here at my YouTube channel Benidorm and Beyond. I produce positive, informative and above all original videos on a weekly basis about Benidorm where I have lived for over two decades now. So if you do enjoy this vlog, please consider becoming a subscriber so you'll never miss any of my brand new content as I upload it in the future. Filmed on a glorious July lunchtime, today I'm taking you for a walk along Avenida de Cuenca, starting at the Hotel Marina at the junction with Calle Girona, or the Strip, and walking all the way down to the beachfront, or Avenida Madrid, at the end. There are a plethora of shops, bars and restaurants on this road, so let's get started. Beginning looking over the sunny terrace of Andy's Bar, we then cross Calle Girona, where we see Planet Benidorm in front of us, which opens daily from noon until 3am. Over on the left-hand side of the street, we pass Tiki City, which opens at 4pm until 3am and has a huge selection of beer bucket deals available, as well as cocktails, sangria and all your favourite mixed drinks. Walking on, we then come to the rock, punk and ska venue, Rock the Casbah, who also serve food and drinks, including everything from Jaeger bombs to delicious ice cream shakes. Next door is an ATM, just inside the premises of Irene's Mini Market, and here you can also buy newspapers, as well as snacks and drinks, and small beach items and suntan oils, etc. Bordering this is the Happy Foods takeaway shop, which was closed on the day I filmed, but maybe opens in the evenings. Next along we find an array of clothes and souvenir shops, selling all the usual items you'd expect, including baseball caps, replica football tops, amusingly worded neon vests, as well as other toys, knickknacks and souvenirs that you'll probably wonder why you bought once you get home, but who can resist a look anyway? And at least they brighten up the street, I guess. Finally, after this arcade of touristy shops, we reach a bar called the Med 23 Pub, formerly the Piccadilly Bar, and this is situated on the corner of Avenidas Cuenca and Avenida del Mediterraneo and offers a large screen TV for showing live sports. Opposite everything we've just passed, we can see a low-rise apartment block on the other side, complete with private parking and gardens, and an ATM on the corner. We now cross the Avenida del Mediterraneo itself and the gates of the Los Ranchos apartment block can just be seen before we move over to the right hand side. Here we see ladies clothes retailer's Esther which has been on this site for many years and sells all sorts of fashion items including children's clothes and sportswear.
We then pass another clothing store and then offers regalos who sell cheap souvenirs and gifts. Continuing on, we find Joselito's barber shop offering discount pensioners haircuts. And after passing an empty unit, we then reach El Punt 24, whose premises consist of a bank of 24-hour vending machines selling hot drinks and snacks to hungry and thirsty passers-by at any hour. Next along, we pass two more ladies' clothes and accessory shops selling a whole array of items that may take your fancy, including dresses, hats, handbags and some rather blingy sandals. Further down, we pass El Rey de las Caramelas Sweet Shop, or the King of the Sweets, and this is followed by Physio Benedorm Physiotherapy Clinic, then Los Hemelos Supermarket, and a large beach shop selling beach items, souvenirs and cold drinks. As we finally approach the beachfront, we can see another barber's shop and unisex hairdresser's Didi. And this is next to the Los Gemelos restaurant and bar, which specialises in paellas and pizzas and has been offering gorgeous sea views from its premises since 1984. Panning back across the road, we see the low-rise apartment block of Los Ranchos that I mentioned earlier with their stripy awnings. And then on the corner and overlooking the Playa Levante, we have the Casa Alamana German restaurant where you can enjoy beers and tapas or maybe a German themed delicacy or two. This brings us bang on to the beautiful Benidorm beachfront and this concludes my information vlog on Calle Cuenca and I really hope you enjoyed walking along it with me. If you did, I would ask you please give this vlog a thumbs up and like it and consider subscribing to my channel if you haven't yet already done so. If you'd like to support my channel and future vlogs by making a small donation, you can now buy me a coffee, or even two or three. Just click on the down arrow next to the vlog title which brings you to the description of this video. Then follow the link provided at the bottom, it's really that simple. Thank you so much. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you out and about next time. Cheers!